Let me good morning, Mike. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, Roger. How are you? Very good. Uh, a little tired. Went to see Hamilton last night. So. <laughs> oh, did you? And it, uh, yeah, it was about 11 o'clock by the time we actually got out of there. <laughs> Great show, though. Makes you awesome. think. Yeah, it makes you think. So, uh, Bombardier, holy cow. Yeah. What's left? Uh, a couple of bread boxes and some pens, right? It's uh, remarkable how, uh, in very short order, this company may be a shadow of its former self, Bombardier. Remember, they built the C Series plane. Yep. There you see it there. The A220 is its, its now new designation because Airbus actually owns a majority stake. Well, Bombardier is selling its remaining interest in this project, which cost an estimated $5 billion, lots of that government money as well. Uh, the province of Quebec is, is maintaining. Uh, uh, an interest in it, so they'll keep jobs in Quebec and such for the A220. But there's also reports this morning, Roger, that Bombardier could sell its rail division, subways, trains, and streetcars to hmm. Alstom of France for about five billion dollars. So they'd be left owning um, business jets. Maybe they might sell those to Textron. They'd already bailed on the a, the Q400 Wait. and the Canada Air regional jets. Would they just exist in name only at that point? No, th theoretically not. I mean, not if, they, if they get rid of the rail and the business jets at, at some point, they just shut it shut it down. It. Well, I mean, the, the the plants and everything would remain in existence. But yeah, I mean, this was where's a company, all this coming from? Well, they they just amassed too much debt and and they've been on a five year restructuring plan and it has not. Uh, paid off. They just reported earnings, another money losing quarter. They did 15 billion in revenue. So we're talking about a massive company here, Roger, mm -hmm. that is quickly transforming itself. And I'm not entirely sure uh, what's going to be left when all is said and done if these other deals that are talked about uh, come to fruition. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Who would yeah. have thunk that? All right, uh, south of the border, let's get this in. Uh the uh, President Donald Trump, yeah. new MAGA. Yes, uh, Make America Great Again. He's now touting uh, Microsoft, Apple, Google, and Amazon. The four companies that are worth a trillion dollars each, uh, each as uh, signs of economic prosperity. And yesterday, Roger, the Dow came within 450 points of closing at 30,000. Holy cow. Yeah, 6,600 at the uh, peak of the financial crisis back in the. 0809 era, so it's it's gone up quite substantially, and those four giant companies are leading the way. Kind of worrisome, though. It makes you think: Are we due for a correction? How can this keep going? Okay. Well, the thing is, quickly, the okay. bubble was built on yeah. debt and a lot of false prospects. Now these companies actually make money, so some of the valuations are justified, maybe stretched, but at least they're uh, you know, the, the, Apple just turned a bill, you know, ten know. plus billion dollar profit in a single quarter. All right, we'll see what happens. Yeah, Mike, thank you, sir. Thank you.